Welcome to the Defeating Epilepsy Foundation YouTube channel. In this presentation, we will discuss what a tonic seizure is, types of tonic seizures, symptoms, diagnosis, treatment options, and what to do if someone has a tonic seizure. Make sure to like our videos and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Click on the bell to be notified of future videos. Please click on our donate link in the description section below and donate today. Your donation helps us to make a difference for those battling epilepsy. We appreciate your support. According to John Hopkins, a tonic seizure causes a sudden stiffness or tension in the muscles of the arms, legs, and trunk. The stiffness lasts on average around 20 seconds and happens most often while the person is asleep. If a tonic seizure occurs while someone is awake, it can put them at high risk for falling. People with Lennox-Gastaut syndrome are more likely to have tonic seizures. Types of tonic seizures are focal tonic seizures, generalized tonic seizures, axial tonic seizures, tonic exhysermelic seizures, global tonic seizures, asymmetric tonic seizures. A focal tonic seizure causes the body to become stiff in one area of the body. The tonic seizure takes place in one area of the brain. Generalized tonic seizures cause the entire body or both sides of the body to become stiff and tense. The seizure is taking place on both sides of the brain. Axial tonic seizures start as a tonic contraction of the neck muscles, leading to the fixation of the head in an erect position, widely opened eyes, and jaw clenching or mouth opening. Contraction of the respiratory and abdominal muscles often follows and may cause the person to experience a brief period of apnea and let out a high-pitched cry. Tonic exorhizomelic seizures cause tonic contractions to extend to the proximal musculature of the upper limbs, elevating the shoulders and abducting the arms. During a global tonic seizure, tonic contractions extend to the periphery of the limbs. The arms are pulled upward to a semi-flexed position in front of the head. The fists are clenched, producing a body position similar to that of a child defending themselves against the facial blow. The lower extremities can also be affected, putting the person at risk for falls. Asymmetric tonic seizures vary from a slight rotation of the head to a tonic contraction of all the musculature on one side of the body. Symptoms of tonic seizures include stiffening or tenseness of the body, onset of sudden forceful movements, gradual stiffening or massive jerk, awareness, if standing, the person may fall at seizure onset. Face and lips may turn blue and appear to stop breathing. Slight confusion after the seizure, occasionally followed by a clonic seizure. The person will rhythmically jerk back and forth. The following are used to make a diagnosis of tonic seizures. EEG electroencephalogram is a test that measures electrical activity in the brain. An EEG is performed by placing electrodes on the scalp, which detect electrical charges from brain activity. EEGs are used to detect abnormal brain activity and the causes of abnormal brain activity. MRI, magnetic renaissance imaging, uses a magnetic field and a computer-generated radio waves to create detailed images of the organs and tissues in your body. Anticonvulsant medication is the most common way to treat tonic seizures. For those who have drug-resistant epilepsy, the keto diet, a high-fat, low-carb diet, can be used as treatment.
Devices such as vagus nerve stimulation can help to reduce seizure activity. Surgery will be used as a last resort if other treatment options do not work. Usually no first aid is needed unless consciousness is effective. People may have several seizures in a row. When happening, make sure the person is in a safe place to prevent further falls and or injuries. If a seizure begins with a fall to the ground, assess for head injury and call someone for first aid if necessary. The person may feel tired, confused or have repeated seizures, so stay with them until they feel well. Preventative care, like wearing a helmet, is a common first aid measure. In conclusion, according to John Hopkins, a tonic seizure causes sudden stiffness or tension in the muscles of the arms, legs, and trunk. There are different types of tonic seizures. They can be focal or generalized. Tests such as an EEG or MRI can help physicians make a proper diagnosis. Anticonvulsant medication, keto diet, devices, and surgery are all treatment options depending on the case. To learn more about tonic seizures, please check out the resources used in the presentation today. Please like and subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us on our social media pages. We would love to hear from you. Leave a comment below or email us at info at defeatingepilepsy.org. Thank you for your support and together we will defeat epilepsy. Check out our other great videos and subscribe today. You have the power to defeat epilepsy.